Hi friends, today I am going to discuss about uh, diurnal attraction. More than 90% of diurnal attraction occurs distal to ampulla of, of water. Ampulla of water is opening in second part of diurnal, which mixes bile with uh, our food. Hence, it occurs most commonly distal to the ampulla of water that is this part is affected more commonly. Antamical variants are of four types. The first type is stenosis. The duodenal area may be stenosed like this. In second part a mucus web may be formed in the lumen and a fibrous uh, tissue formation due to uh, necrosis may occur. And mucosal formation is called as windsock deformity. Fibrous cord uh, may occur due to necrosis, and there will be gap between uh, proxim duodenum, two parts of duodenum, proximal and distal. All these are the anatomical variants. Coming to associated anomalies, cardiac, renal, or associated. Uh, Anomalies are associated with duodenal atresia, prematurity, Down syndrome, polyhydramnias are also associated with this condition. Other uh, things like mole rotation, annular pancreas, and biliary atresia are also associated with this condition. Coming to the presentation. The unit presents with bilious warmth most commonly on first day. The reason for bilious warmth is this. It occurs as in distal to the ampulla of water where bile mixes. Coming to midgut valvulus, bilious warmth will might not be present on one day but it, it occurs in within the first week of life. Coming to X-ray abdomen, double bubble sign is the most important thing we have to remember in this. What is this, what is this sign? Consider this an erect X-ray abdomen. This is a air, field, air fluid level in stomach, and this one is an air fluid level in the odonum. This is called double bubble sign. This double bubble sign is also can be can also be seen in annular pancreas and lats band. Any second part of the odonum uh, uh, malformation can leads to this. Diagnosis is confirmed by when there is no distal air in the X-ray abdomen. If distal air present, upper J contrast study will be done to differentiate uh, between um, diurnal atresia and midgut valves. Treatment is diurno diurnostomy. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe, like, comment, share. Have a nice day.